Got a report that Mr. Negative's near Feast in Chinatown. But nothing from Miles. Do you think... Miles is fine. We're out looking for him now. Find Lee. Miles has to be there too. He has to be. I'll go check it out. If he so much as laid a hand on Miles. Hello? It's Dr. Connors. Sorry, I asked Harry for your number. <clears throat> I just... Please, come back to the lab. We need to remove the symbiote. The hold that it's already taking on your mind, it's only going to get worse. I'm busy. No one listens. parts of me here. I'm not looking for a fight. Craven has the other Spider-Man trapped in an old mansion east of the city. He saved me. Told me to find you. This was the only way I knew how. I owe him my life, and much more. If we hurry... No. You've done enough. You should be proud of him. He reminds me of you. Reminds him of me. He doesn't even know me. Or Miles. A little bit of help now, all of a sudden he's a good guy. As soon as Miles is safe, Lee's going back in a cell. Not now, MJ. Is Spider-Man doing more harm than good? How about now? Now who needs the old Spider-Man? What's so great about the new Spider-Man anyway? He can't even stop some hunters. They destroyed the EMF. Destroyed my life. I'm going to lose May's house because of them and Craven. Kill Craven. Spider will survive. Where is he? Where is Spider Man? Find him yourself. Stay focused. Find him. Find me. Have a shot. Tell me where he is. Tell me!
I'm assured that material is unbreakable. But I believe anything can be broken. Shut up! 
I know you're here! Capable of defeating me! Enough talking! And then I found you. And you'll regret that! That sound! I can't! And you'll regret that! No, I won't. I will not let God decide my fate! Fight me yourself! Just me. You almost killed him, man. What are you doing? You're in the way, Miles. Always in the way. I could have fixed everything. How? By strangling him? That's not what we do. Try to mentor me. You're the one running away from your problems. You're the one hell bent on revenge! Revenge? All I wanted was to protect my family! Protect you! You're not better than me! I'm not saying that! You're stronger than some soup, Pete! Don't listen to it! And what? Listen to you? Yes! Listen to me! What are you so afraid of? 
Last few days. Miles, I'm sorry. Thank you for everything. That's what Spider Man do. <clears throat> Spider Man didn't save me back there, Miles did. <clears throat> what now? Dr. Connors. He said he knows how to destroy it. Wait, what about Harry? Doesn't he kind of need it? His dad is working on another cure. One that doesn't involve aliens. You know, if you need me, I'm just a call away. Well, once I let my mom know this, she still has a son. I know. It's glad to have you back, man. Contained, but what do I do now? Bring it to Oscorp Tower. There's a tank there that will subdue it. I have to prep a few things first, but I'll let you know when I'm on my way. One thing before we meet. Now that the symbiote is off of you, how are you feeling? Fine. Relieved that it's over. Ashamed at what I did. It's not your fault. There's still so much we don't know. Tell me right away if you feel any changes in mood, behavior... But it's off me. I'm cured, right? Very likely. Yes. Just do your best to keep that thing contained. Copy that. <sighs> okay. I've been ignoring the city for too long. Someone's reporting something dick. Dangerous in their yard. Sounds like a job for me. A monster? In Queens? Better check it out. Told MJ yet? Hello? MJ, I got the suit off. And I'm so sorry for. Go on. 
for treating you and everyone I care about like absolute crap. I'm heading to Oscorp to store the suit until Dr. Connors and I can figure out what to do. Does Harry know? No. But Norman's been working on an alternate cure that's showing real promise. We can still... We will save Harry. Well, it's a relief to hear you sounding like yourself again. Go wrap things up. I'll see you at home. I've got a lot more apologies to make when this is all set. Hello, ma'am. Who's there? I don't recognize your voice. It, it's Spider-Man? Oh, I didn't realize. Alba, charmed to meet you. So, you need my help? Yes. There's a monster in my backyard. I can hear it at night. Scratching. Could it be a stray dog? Or a rat? My allergies could sense a stray dog half a mile away. And even New York rats don't get as big as whatever that is. Is there anybody else here who might have noticed it? Family member? Guide dog? Just me. No family. No neighbors. No service animals. Allergies, remember? Whatever it is, I need it gone. Got it. I'll look around and let you know what I find. Please, I cannot afford to repair any more damage. Fixed income, you know. What are you doing up here? Did Craven's tiger get loose? Fret not, gnome. I shall avenge thee. Definitely an animal. Well, that's disgusting. Time for some molecular assessments. Let's see here. Traces of the chemical. Looks like it came from the woods. Trail ends here. There might be another clue nearby. These look promising. So it's something strong enough to rip through metal. Great. More gunk. Whatever it is, it's either leaky or slobbery. Blech. This stuff leaves a real strong trail. This thing is way too heavy to be a big cat. But it sure can jump like one. Feels like I'm getting warmer. Where is this thing going? Oh, maybe Ganky knows something about this thing. Uh, hello? Hey, Ganky, that monster in Queens? It's one of those hunter beasts, but it's not attacking. Oh, a hunter beast? Maybe we can hack it. It could give us some intel. There's something in its side. An arrow? Easy. This won't hurt. Probably. This 
since, you know, you're metal. This was kind of a desperate move, but I dumped 10 million random dog videos to its pattern recognition database. Nice! What should we do with this thing? Is it dangerous? Uh, try fetch? You wanna get the barrels? Are you a happy puppy? Wanna play chase? That's it, good dog, get him! I'll try to access its memories while it's distracted. Man, a lot of corruption in the closet. So, the arrow. Why would hunters shoot their own robot pets? Target practice? Let's find out. Hey, what's your name, anyway? Designation F1D0. Fido. Good to know at least one hunter has a sense of humor. This log is cached to a server. Dare I? How deeply do you believe in your firewall? Deeply enough to download this audio playback. Get out of my world, you piece of junk. She's a trite and a private. You are the traitor. I was doing my job. No. Oh, defective garbage, get back here. We've got company. We must have tricked our log access. Easy, easy, stay. Heal, buddy! Heal! Genki, send in a stop command! I can't access manual override. Oh, always wanted to say that. Focus! I think it's scared! It's definitely acting like it. Maybe that recording scared it! Repressed final memories? Always bad. I think its owner shot it. And covered up a murder! Why don't stop? No, 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 not the church! There you are. Come here. Yeah. I should have blown you to bits with an explosive boat. Oh. Yeah. Come here. Yeah. I can't let you do anything. Yeah. You are a defective for the trash. Fido's not going anywhere with you. You yeah. haven't found it. That's all of them. Fido! Okay, don't worry. He won't hurt you anymore. Now, let's take care of that arrow. Okay, let's have a look. A little pinch. Ready? Good boy. You sure this is safe? Hey, if 10 million dog videos can't make you a good boy, there's no hope for any of us. And you're a good boy, aren't you? Who's a good boy? Just to be safe, though, I'll wipe its memory completely. Except the videos. And you. Good call. We're back. Spider-Man? Wait, we? Me and this curious guy. <gasps> Oh, oh, no. My allergies. It's okay. Earlier you mentioned you couldn't get a guide animal? Well, I found you one. He's a dog. I guess. Made of various metals. Very allergy friendly. He's also got a few hundred guide dog videos uploaded to his memory. Really? He's everything I hoped for. I can have him trained at the center, so he can be properly registered. Already so helpful. Thank you, Spider-Man. Adios!
Okay. I'm heading over to Oscorp Tower now. Right. See you there. All right. What do we got? I don't fabricate information just because of my personal leadings. What I'm hearing, I take no pleasure in delivering to you. But it's my duty to report it nonetheless. It seems the newer Spider-Man has gone missing. Now, we can all agree these vigilantes need to be brought to justice. But it seems that may never come to pass. A trusted source claims they saw firsthand Spider-Man captured by the Hunters. Now, their track record speaks for itself. Should the worst befall this young man, I will be the last person to say, I told you so. Even though I was the first person to say it. Despite my campaign against these dangers to society, I don't wish harm on any other human being. So let us all come together and hope for Spider-Man's sake that he survives this ordeal. So he can face the courts and the punitive justice he deserves. Welcome to my mysterious... I don't know where I am! Help! Just sit tight. I'll find you. My illusions will never die. But you... Okay, Miles. Remember, everything's an illusion. Even that fake Mysterio. Illusion is an illusion. Hmm. I promise this poison gas is not an illusion. Tick tock! Whoa! This sure doesn't feel like an illusion. How are they doing this? First things first, we have to put together a pitch for investors. Wait, Cole, are you recording? Yep, we're rolling. I don't understand why we have to record all this. Because we're all going to be famous one day. And our fans are going to want to peek behind the curtain, so to speak. Ugh, okay. Well, for the pitch, I can put together a prototype illusion that will blow your mind. Great idea. We also still need to come up with a name for our attractions. How about... Mysterians? No. No, no. We will not use the name Mysterio in any way, shape, or form. People are gonna call you Mysterio whether you like it or not. But I am not Mysterio anymore. I am Quentin Beck. Master Illusionist! Beck didn't want to be a bad guy anymore. Good for him.
Okay, let's talk image. We'll want to assure investors you're not the criminal you once were. I've done my time. Shouldn't that be enough? Unfortunately not. Let's talk about your origin. What led you to become Mysterio in the first place? I... <laughs> Is this really necessary? If you want to be successful, yes. I... I guess it was ego, mostly. We all have egos, Quentin. Oh, not like mine. Former supervillain has a big ego. Go figure. Looks like I got a message. Spider-Man, Betsy here. Quentin and Cole are scrubbing through all the very helpful data you've provided. And I was thinking, when the Mysteriums are back to operating safely, it'd be great to get a Spider-Man endorsement. Pro bono, of course. <laughs> We're running out of capital here, and it's Quentin quite anxious. Anyway, just a thought. No need to call back. Uh, Bye. Sorry, Betsy. We have a firm rule against body endorsements. Might want to rethink that business plan.
running out of time, Spider-Man! that isn't just words. New York needs us. Spider-Man needs us. Remember friend of the pod, Dennis? Savior of the subway? Dennis is out there right now, leading a search party, 50 people strong, looking for the missing Spider-Man. And dang it, I, I am wrapping early today so I can join him. Check my socials for the meetup deeds. We just, we gotta do something, folks. Come on. Let's be heroes. This is more than it This may get violent. Get me out of here! That's the plan. Be sure to look both ways before crossing, Spider-Man. I know this is all an illusion, but it feels so real. However much time you need, you're safe. Another message from Betsy. Hi, Spider-Man. Betsy here again. I have Cole here with me while Quentin is off doing some focused work. You mean off being all weird and moody? Dude needs to talk to me. Yes, well, I'm working on getting him some help. We're all a little stressed, which is why I'd like to ask if you can expedite your work on the Mysteriums. The sooner we can fix this, the sooner Quentin will return to his usual brilliant self. Sounds like Beck is taking this hard. I feel for him. This is more than an illusion. This may get violent! Get me out of here! Help! I'm working on it! Move fast, Spider-Man, or you'll never escape. Can't let him hit me! Cannot escape me! Yeah. 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 
this time, you cannot see reality. You can only feel it. <sighs> Deep. familiar it's because he's a multi-millionaire with his name on everything because his money is in everything so we have a special guest today to drop some knowledge on us about an exciting new opportunity for budding artists to share in the joys of responsible art please welcome renowned street artist and head of the cooper art coalition Haley cooper hi danica i'm genki lee Haley's interpreter she's signing next to me she says she's concerned? Oh, excited to be here. Uh, I'm still learning. <laughs> Fantastic. Welcome, both of you. So, Haley, tell us all about your coalition. Thanks, Danica. Thanks for interpreting, Genki. You're doing great. Uh, aw, thanks. Uh, I was... Okay. Finally unscrambles that third-party ping. It's using the same code and frequency as us. Did someone steal our tech? No way. We keep that locked up tight. Are you sure? I mean, unless there's another Spider-Man out there, but that's... Nah. I'll keep digging. Maybe if you send me a few more, I can figure this out. Where?
All good. Just take it easy. We've been through a lot. Betsy called again? Let's see what she had to say. Hello, Spider-Man. Um, I just wanted to let you know that Quinn has agreed to enter some court monitor accounts to help him with his post-prison transition. Finally. Cole, please be respectful. He's been through a lot. Sorry. I'm just... I'm just glad he's getting help, you know? Anyway, Quinn asked me to pass this along. He thinks he's close to figuring out what's going on. So just keep up the good work, Spider-Man. Good on Beck for going into counseling. We all need help sometimes. Skepticism will save you. Okay, mystery person. Keep that in mind. Spider-Man's I was so grateful, I decided to name my new hamster after him. 
It meant a lot that he took the time to help me, given how much he's had to deal with lately. Sometimes, the smallest good things make great things. If you read this, thanks for reading. Sincerely, Odyssey. Oh, Odyssey, I love stories like this. Small things make such a difference. So, here is my challenge for all of you. Do something small today. Give a stranger a compliment, buy a friend a copy, put a coin in the meter next to yours, anything. You never know what good it will do. Well, that seems like enough advice for this episode. Take the most care, everyone, and take care of each other. Be safe now. Another call from Betsy. Spider Man? Cole and I are a bit concerned. He said he was gonna kill us. Please, Cole, don't panic. <sighs> Spider Man, we found out Quentin lied to us. Instead of going to counseling, he went somewhere else. When we confronted him, he said some threatening things and then left. Hopefully he just needs to cool off, but if you see him or hear from him, can you let us know? Thank you. Uh, this just went from bad to worse. Why are you recording us having lunch? I figured our fans will want to know a little about you and how you got to know Quentin. He was my neighbor growing up. We played together sometimes, but then he went to a different school. He was way more advanced than the rest of us regular kids. I can totally see that. Was he always so creepy and weird? Cole, that's... <laughs> that's not nice. I mean, don't get me wrong. He's harmless, I think. But if I could find another job, I would. You're making the right choice to stay. He's a genius. As soon as the world sees what we're doing, we're all going to be very, very rich. 
Betsy knew Beck from way back. And she's all in. But it sounds like Cole has her doubts. I got some bad news. Our pitch was rejected. By who? Everyone. Ah! Uh, idiots! Can't they see how we're creating the future of entertainment? Oh, they love the technology. Just not the talent. You mean me? The ex-con? Let's come up with a different strategy. We've got something amazing here. We can make this work. Somehow. I feel bad for Beck. Gotta be tough trying to shake a reputation like that. Gather round, team. Got some good news. We got our funding! Finally! Who's the investor? Me! I secured a business loan, with some appalling terms, but at least it got approved! Betsy, I'm flattered you'd put so much faith in me, but... Not just you, Quentin. In all three of us. I have full confidence we will make this venture successful. Betsy went all in on Beck. She must really believe in him. Quentin, we need to talk. As you can see, I'm busy. I'm sensing some emotions from you right now. Emotions? You know, when I was in prison, I learned a lot about emotions. How to control them. I know you're upset about the whole Mysterium thing, Quentin. But you need to get on board here. The Mysterio name is marketable. Quentin Beck is not. Without Quentin Beck? You'd have nothing to sell. So it seems like you need to get on board with me and my emotions. Sounds like things were getting spicy between Betsy and Beck. Cole, you're bleeding. Yeah, I know. What the hell, man? It appears to be a minor injury. Wait, these illusions are just illusions, right? I think I cracked a tooth. Well, the illusions should be harmless. Unless someone's doing something they shouldn't be doing. Right, Cole? Uh, don't look at me like that. This was not my fault. Well then, this is quite the mystery. Was Cole hurt in an accident? Or did Beck do it on purpose because he was salty about having to use the name Mysterio? Quentin, Quentin, we have to talk. You seem to want to talk a lot. But what is it that you actually do as part of this endeavor? <clears throat> Cole discovered some hidden routines in the Mysterium code. We can scan bank cards in our customers' pockets? A 21st century parlor trick. We use that information to look at their purchase history, browsing history, create a bespoke world that makes our audience believe in the unbelievable. But if it gets out that we have people's bank information... I'm the only one with the encryption codes. And I haven't told anyone. What about you? No, of course not. Then as long as you and Cole keep it to yourselves, our secret is safe. Right? Right. Beck was scanning people's credit cards to customize his illusions? Sounds like something the old Mysterio would do. You sure he's not listening? He has his tricks, you know. No, we're safe. <sighs> He's acting very weird. You mean weirder? He's gone quiet all of a sudden. Won't speak to me. Do we have a way out in case he gets violent or something? We'll be fine. Here he comes. Let's talk more later. Sounds like Cole and Betsy were scared of Beck's change in behavior. Hmm. Got a new voicemail. Spider-Man, we need to meet. Come to Coney Island, I have an urgent matter to discuss with you. Well, that doesn't sound like a trap at all. Just hope he hasn't hurt Betsy and Cole.
turn me down? Okay, where's Beck? Welcome, Spider-Man. If you're looking for Betsy and Cole, they are no longer with us. You killed them? Don't act surprised. You've known from the beginning who you're dealing with. What the... Give a 
cow, and I will spare your life. No thanks. Giving up isn't really my thing. It's over. So, you managed to survive. Doesn't it matter? Alive or dead, you will never escape my world. Nice try. Clever Spider-Man. You cannot win. I am infinite. When you are dead, the city will finally give me the respect I have earned. You want respect? Then stop all this! Some respect on my name. Time to get out of here. The sim is down. Get it back. I'm trying. It was Quentin. He made us do this. Where is he? Oh, in here. Questions. This probably should clear things up. So can I tell everyone Mysterio's a good guy now? <laughs> Mysterio will always be a villain. Just as Spider-Man will always be a hero. It's when you start looking at the people behind the masks that things get messy. I think he's on to us. If so, there's only one solution. We need him alive. What do we do, just tie him up or something? Yes, good idea. We set him up as the fall guy in case anyone catches on. Yeah, like tell everyone he went full Mysterio? Exactly. 
he would be the one most likely to steal money, not the two women who aren't former supervillains. Now we just need to figure out how to get the richest people in the city into these Mysteriums. Okay, but there's still some code that I haven't figured out, and... The Spider-Men will help us with that. Ha! <laughs> That's brilliant! Heroes always looking to help. And if all goes to plan, we'll have millions in the bank before anyone catches on. And when they do, Quentin goes back to prison, and we retire in style. Looks like the biggest illusion was Betsy and Cole's innocence. Wonder where Beck is going from here. Cocktail competition is going. Hey, you pay for that photo, Spider Man? I'm just kidding. You're fool. Oh, no. You're radical. I heard this guy dips his hot dog buns in tomato juice before eating them. Now, I get that it makes it easier for them to go down, but tomato juice? Brother, that ain't right. I couldn't back now, too. Crystal? These things are everywhere. <clears throat> Sorry to break it to you, but the beach is that way. this crystal in peace. I lose the grapes at the school and come home. Walk through the front door. But you're not there. They are. What have they done to you, Kimia? Craven's real twisted for putting Marco's kid in the middle of all this. Gotta look for more crystals to find out what happened. Marco's memory is returning, and he's agitated. The doctors are piecing together what happened. It, it sounds like it's not all his fault. I'll let you know if I hear more. <clears throat> Protecting! Yeah. Uh. 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 
our regularly scheduled programming. Sand crystal time. I start yelling, losing my cool. If they did anything to you, I can feel the sand about to take over. And then they splash me with some chemical. Don't know what it is, but trying my hardest to stay awake. I'm fading fast until I see black. Must have used some strong stuff to knock out Sandman. But what happened to Kimia? Finally got it off. My hero. Harry. We've got to destroy it. It's too dangerous. I don't want you to lose yourself. Like I did. Pete. Please. You don't understand. Connor said it was... I saved your life? And you won't save mine? Do you want me to die? Here, you. Oh, God. Harry. No! Don't hurt him! I know we'll find one. And... And... 
kill you out there! I can't lose you too!
You will be my final hunt, and I shall be your first! Let us show the world what death should be! You want death? Then give up! I want it to be worthy of me! Do you know what it's like to have your body betray you? Weakness will not claim me! If I am to die soon, I will die roaring! I don't... What did I just do? Don't be scared, honey. You finally have the power to do what we've always wanted. We're going to heal the world. How? Let me show you. find you out there. Are 
EMF badges were RF enabled. If Harry's still wearing his badge, I can use Oscorp satellite dishes to find him. Please be wearing that badge. Great, getting a strong signal that way. Time to move. This signal is moving around. It's gotta still be on Harry. Ugh. I was such a jerk to Harry when I had that suit. I need to find him, apologize, and try to get through to him. Closing in on you, buddy. Help's on the way. Hang in there. We'll get this thing off you. And I'll work with your dad and Dr. Connors to get you fixed up. Somehow. The signal stopped moving. Stay there, buddy. Let's pinpoint his location a bit more. He's got to be under that overpass. What is all this stuff? Harry, are you back here? Damn, just his badge. Maybe he's still around here somewhere. I know he'll listen to me if I can just get through to him. Yes, there you are. Harry? It's me. Hey, Harry. Can you hear me? Listen, we're gonna figure out a cure. Something better. Harry? <laughs> You're not... Having that extra symbiote strength right now! Oh no, more. Did Harry turn these people into symbiotes somehow? This is horrific. How do I stop them without hurting them? I freed one of them! Just stay calm! Don't move! You'll be okay! I hope... God, these things are brutal! Gonna need Miles' help! You reach Miles. Tell me something good. Miles, there's trouble with Harry! He got the suit back, and it changed him! He's turning people into symbiotes somehow! I'm holding my own! It's like punching molasses! We gotta find a better way to get these things off of people! Call me! I gotta find Harry and stop him before this gets worse! Miles, I need help with these things. Got your messages. Sorry, I've been looking for my mom. Assume you saw Craven's dead? What? No. You think it was Harry? Maybe. Probably. We gotta stop him. Okay, I've got an idea. When you were under the influence, a certain sounds made you weak. That bell. But we can't just carry it around. No, but I have this mixing app on my phone. I can recreate the bell sonic elements. Then we can use it against Harry and his army. That's genius. Glad you decided to study music tech. Feel free to share that opinion with the college acceptance board. 
What's up, Genki? There you are. Your mom and we I were are looking for you. And I was looking for you. I texted you. I was okay. Well, I didn't get it because we've been on the subway looking for you. We're glad you're okay. I'll ride with your mom back home. Can you meet us? You gotta deal with something first, but I'll be there as soon as I can. Okay. Gotta recreate the sound of Craven's Bell. What sounds can I use around here? Perfect. Same shape as Craven's Bell. Even if it's a tenth the size. Serious echo chamber. Could come in handy. How do I get the bell into that hangar? That container looks promising. If I drop it, I'll get some nice resonance. Yes! Recorded it. Symbiote! How'd they get uptown so fast? Sorry I punched you. Just stay down until I'm done here. People's rights! These things are fierce! Gotta remember there are people in there. Better finish off this mix before more of them show up. Now to ring the bell. There's the engine, but no power. Here we go. Yes. Super Echo recorded. Almost done. Just need a low frequency boost. With a pulse. Something like... A helicopter's blades. Gotta get up there. you 
I'm here. What I miss? Very funny. Let me transfer these sounds. Hopefully this will. Come on, come on. Go. Nice job, Miles. Now let's save these people. We did it! I dropped the pin for EMTs. They'll take care of these people. Good thinking. Subway is messed up. The train is totally stuck. Like goo on the window. Yankee? For Douglas Circle. There's a bunch of us. Yankee, we're on our way. Great. Get here, mijo. I love you. Love you too. Why is Harry doing this? <clears throat> Creating all these things. I don't think Harry's the one doing it. At least not the Harry I know. Then who is? The symbiote? Yeah. I'm no expert, but it seems like it's trying to make itself a new home. Big Douglas Circle. There's a bunch of us. Yankee, we're on our way. Great. Get here, mijo. I love you. Love you too. Why is Harry doing this? Creating all these things. I don't think Harry's the one doing it. At least not the Harry I know. Then who is? The symbiote? Yeah. I'm no expert, but it seems like it's trying to make itself a new home. <laughs> Harry? That's Harry? Find him later. Right now, we need to save your mom and Ganky. Watch yourself! Uh, Harry looked a lot different than you did when you had the suit. I think that would have been me eventually if you hadn't saved me. Uh, uh, you gotta check in with mom and Ganky. Uh, they're not answering. Uh, we gotta get in there. We will! As soon as we clear the area. What if they turned into one of these things? Don't think about that. Let's just fight these things and get in there. I did it. Spider-Man, it's you. Yeah, the doors are stuck. We gotta move these tendrils somehow. You need to hurry. All these tendrils are alive. There's gotta be a central nerve somewhere. Bingo! Let's hit a nerve. He's pulling back! But not enough. They're still trying to get into the trains. There's gotta be another nerve cluster around here. Oh, wow. Too big for a single sonic burst. Think we can chain some together? Yeah. We don't need time to sync up. How much time does it need? Bro, did you hear that? How much time? A minute? Maybe a little more? Keep your spidey sense sharp. This might get wild. These things really don't want us here. Get them right on time. Good one. That's good! Uh. 
I know! Just keep moving! Get to your mom and Genki. Spider-Man! You're okay. What happened? I took your advice. I let go of some things that didn't serve me. Come on. Okay. That really sucks. I thought I was gonna die. My life was flashing before my eyes. You're good, man. That time when we went mini golfing for my birthday and I got that hole in one to win, I cheated. I could pick up the ball and dropped it in when you weren't looking, and I. You were eight. And honestly, I never liked the sandwiches you traded for at lunch, but I went along with it because I knew how much you loved my mom's banchan, and I'm seeing someone new, by the way. Her name's Andy, and she's great, and please don't kill me, but I just thought of a sequel for Sweden Onagon, and I... Wait, wait, wait. Andy from Kim? Ah, oh, she's real cool. <laughs> Thanks for saving us. Look, I'm sorry I've been so busy. I'll do better. Make the time to hang out. Be careful. Genki, let's get uptown. I'll make you something good for dinner. Next step? Find Harry. I'll take downtown. I got uptown. While I'm looking for Harry, I should check in on some other things. Center for New York tourism. Now, the scene of a deadly bloodbath. Unless you've been living under a rock, you've seen the photos released in Times Square, where we've learned Sergei Craven, also known as Craven, leader of the hunt, has been brutally murdered by a monstrous unknown assailant. The most interesting piece of information to arise out of this catastrophe. The horrendous behemoth behind the homicide was sporting the same damn spider logo of New York's own Spider-Man. The day I've prophesied and rightly feared may have come to pass. Spider-Man has perhaps transformed into a merciless creature capable of apocalyptic levels of destruction. This is the result of unchecked power and unsupervised will. I'm sure that if this is indeed Spider-Man, he's most likely prepared a hit list of those he's perceived to have wronged him. Dear listeners, I can only assume I'm high on that list. If this animal decides to exact his vengeance upon me, may my story be a lesson to you all. Do not let my life be in vain. Band together, and we can stand up against these formidable powers once and for all. But until that day comes, I'll be fighting alongside you.
for the good of our people and the good of our nation. Kenki, what's up? Hey, Mr. Parker. Um, you've been dealing with those fire cult guys, right? The followers of the flame? Yeah. I'm seeing reports on social media say they spotted a few of them on a rooftop in Brooklyn. I'll send you the details. I'll check it out. Thanks, Genki. Is the Crimson Hour about to start? watch on that scrapyard nearby and there's some burned up papers about Oscorp I better get down there great they're still setting up but this doesn't look like an Oscorp property what are they the crimson hour won't be long now my embers can you feel it Soon enough. <laughs> All those innocent people. Gotta disable these bombs before they can hurt the civilians in those buildings. I can do this. So this is the Crimson Hour. Burning Brooklyn and everyone in it to the ground. Way too late to try to evacuate everyone. That rooftop bomb alone could take out the entire apartment building. We all knew this day would come. Or at least the worthy did. Is someone the there? Unworthy? You'd think the unworthy of our buildings would have noticed that. Walking the streets. Ignoring the cars there. We're cleaning this place up. The mission is seen it before the. Oh. So we can always remember them 
as what they truly were. Undeserving. Unprincipled. Unbecoming. Unsuitable. Undignified. Unworthy! Fool's beacon. Just look at this <laughs> From the lowest top all the guys That's two. If I hadn't stopped Yuri. No. The Crimson Hour always had to begin Always. But rest assured, you will not be confined here. No. As I heard earlier, it will roll across this earth like blood on steel and this I can't even think about it! I'm so excited! We're gonna burn them all! Things don't find you, Spider-Man! going offline. Do it? 
Now oh, tell me. It's gonna hit the tankers. You've stopped trains before, right? Yeah. No brakes. Great. Not working! Got any ideas? We derail it. How are we supposed to do that? Can't believe we're doing this. Really? Last shot. You're gonna have to make up a new prophecy. Before you and I met, one of my embers told me about his work at Oscorp and this treatment that they had discovered. Who cares, right? Fancy suit that can make you big and strong is just another case of the unworthy trying to cheat death and play God. That's what I thought, too. But... When devils attack the city... Like I prophesied! Oscorp sent out some of this treatment for safekeeping. I knew it was meant for me. That's what all this was for. And when the Crimson Hour rolls over this earth, it shall bring truth. Judgment. And carnage. underground just like last time but I'll find him you could have killed him but you saved me instead I told you I'm trying to save the most lives and you still do that pretty well you gonna turn me in now I'll let you know when I find him We stopped him from taking innocent lives in the process. Hey, Yuri. Do you want help tracking down the flame? Thanks, but 
I need some time to myself. But we have taken down a good chunk of his operation, so he'll be going back to the drawing. I'll start checking his old age. Archie Abel, Walter Wackman, Cletus Cassidy. But this could take months, maybe even years. I'll be ready when you've got something. Thanks. I couldn't turn her in after she saved me. Maybe I... <sighs> Maybe Harry's back at his place. Can't hurt to check. Are you okay? I'm worried about Harry. And I have no one else to talk to. He's, um... Not himself right now. And it's all my fault. It's mine, too. Harry told me about his treatment. I knew something was off, but... I was just happy he was back. I should have told him that more. You still can. I'll let you know if I hear from him, Mr. Osborne. Okay. I appreciate it. No sign of Harry. What's that? Happy birthday, Em. They say time heals all wounds. That's a lot. Every day without you is worse than the last. If I lose Harry, I... I don't know what I'll do. Norman's really hurting. I need to find Harry and save him. Haven't heard from MJ in a while. I should give her a call. I hate this. I love this. You do? <laughs> You've hit the nail on the head. Finally! Top story. Everybody's talking about it. This is editor material. Editor? Congratulations. Your first assignment, write more juicy stuff by tomorrow morning. Drama, controversy, just like this. Like this. Get writing! <sighs> MJ. I, uh, didn't get fired from the Bugle. In fact, I think I, I got a promotion. Hey, that's what you wanted, right? Yeah, I, I thought it was. Then that's... Great. Hey, listen. Something's gone wrong with Harry. What... what happened? Well... Hang on, someone's at the door. It's kind of hard to explain. Just promise me you'll stay away from him, okay? MJ? MJ, pick up! Hey, it's MJ. You can leave Damn a message, it. but why would you? If it's important, just, you know, text. Please be okay. Spider-Man, how are you feeling? Anxious? Panicked? I meant, uh, physical symptoms. Soreness? Fatigue? Yes. Wait, symptoms? I've been looking through years of research notes. The symbiote channels a collective consciousness. That hive mind I was in was always optimistic. It may still be inside you. What? Nothing to panic about, but perhaps you should come to the lab for some tests. Can't, Doc. It's bigger problems. Gotta go.
MJ! Where's... Harry. Pete? You look tense. Coffee? We need to talk. You must get tired making the world a better place every single day. But I can help. All you have to do is let me. This isn't you. Wrong. This is the real me. I finally have the power to realize our vision. Are you giving up on me? Harry, we need to get that thing off you. Do not call us a thing. Job with Harry. We'll be okay. And for how long? 
There's only one job you care about! Spider-Man! That's not fair! People need me! You know that! What would the city do without Spider-Man? Look how it's doing with you! I can still fix this! I always do! Uh, we always do! I always come second! I live in your shadow where my dreams turn to dust! That is the truth! What are you saying? You do make a difference! What you do matters! I know you're in there! No more! Remember your book? You said you want to help people! Nobody read it! Nobody cares! It's not true! If I helped one person, it was worth it! I read it! It helps me! All I do is help you! MJ! My, my life is constantly interrupted by you! Looking for answers! Please! Because you lost a job on the hand pay of Bill! I write words I don't believe! The pain! I write words I don't believe in for a man I despise! So you can be happy! I didn't realize! MJ, you can quit! I can figure something out! I can't trust you! I can only rely on us! No! I'm sorry, MJ! I was wrong! You don't have to trust me! But please, trust yourself! Let me do what I have to do! You're right! I've been selfish! I was so wrapped up in my own life, I never thought about yours! But let's handle this MJ's way! Let me help you fight this! You. I need you. Don't lie to me! Pete! I need you too!
what you want. How do you know what we want? You're Mary Jane Watson. You want the truth. the truth. symbiote. For months I've been trying to be something I'm not. I'm glad you're back. Sorry. It wasn't you. And I wasn't me earlier. Pete, I... Pete, it... It was like some kind of hive mind in there. I saw you. And Harry, he, he was going after this rock. Miles is at City Hall. Go. I love you. I love you. Things got complicated. I'll be there soon. Do you think this is Harry? It has to be. I just saw him in Queens. He turned MJ into one of those symbiotes, but worse. What? She's okay. She broke out of it. Luckily, faster than I did. Connors thinks I had the suit on too long, and now some of it is left inside of me. You really meant it when you said things were complicated. One thing at a time. See you soon, Miles. I hear that. See you. Reminds me, I owe someone else a call. Peter? Hey, Ms. Morales. You, uh, make it home safe? I was just, you know, I, I wanted to make sure. We're fine, we're fine. And Peter, we're fine, too. But next time, answer my calls. Trust me, I'll be on my best behavior. You'd better be. Now go help my son. Suit. <sighs> Bad news. 
seen reports that whatever that black suit was may now be spreading through parts of the city. The two connected? Maybe. But right now isn't the time for speculation. It's the time for action. We're getting scattered reports of folks going missing. Our favorite subway worker, Dennis, is running a database of missing persons. Check the description for details. Let's crowdsource this, everyone. Get as much data in there as we can. We can't leave the protection of New York just to the Spider-Man anymore. Let's be heroes. Put you on hold. Harry's been busy. Yeah. Well, good thing the cleanup crew's here. Than I thought. There's no sign of hair. He has to be here. I think you told me there are a bunch of civilians trapped inside. Apparently, they were using this place as shelter. We'll get them out safe and sound. How are there this many? Looks like he's trying to build an army. If you ask him, he's trying to heal the world. A bunch of messages on the app from people inside City Hall. They're trying to evacuate onto the roof. Can we better clear a path? There's an emergency exit up there. Let's go. Yeah. <laughs> 
are you doing here? Are you all right? Spider-Man! He said there was still some of this thing inside him. I see. I think I can clear it out of him. But only if I go to the source. I'm going in with you. Plan here, Lee. Find Spider-Man. All of this dark matter should lead us toward him. All right. On my way. Where are we anyway? We are inside Spider-Man's mind. We've seen what those creatures do to people around the city. Get in your head. And twist your desires. Mad they stole your routine? I know you're joking. You're making my point. This thing it fears my power for some reason. And I, we, are the only ones who can find where it lives. So we clear this thing out at the roof. And Spider Man's free? That's the plan. All right then. Stronger hold on them than I thought. All right. Weaken the symbiote, take back control, use our powers to save Spider Man. Where do we start? We have to find the source of his pain. Follow me. I'll try and lead you to where it's darkest. But I can't promise what we'll find. Spider-Man would think about this place. Most of us are here because of him. Down here. I think I found some. I think... Miles! Them all. The problem solved. That's not what Pete thinks. No, but it might be how he feels. All these villains. He really thought the suit could solve it all. 
Is that? Me. You caused a lot of pain, man. The debt I will spend the rest of my life repaying. There's something up ahead. You're close. Ace House. I haven't asked Pete about her in a long time. What's wrong with me? When you get caught up in one part of your life, it's easy for the rest to fall away. She's dead because of you. Your power does have the same effect in here. Yeah. I guess it does. around this place. This will probably be the closest I'll ever get to seeing the inside of it again. Not that I deserve to. Lee, why did you do it? What did you want? Revenge. Norman Osborne's the reason my parents are dead. So I dedicated my life to making his hell. I'm sorry, Miles. Up there. That's the source. If we clear this out, we just might be able to save it. I can transfer all of my power into the symbiote. I think that could neutralize it. And free Peter. What'll happen to you? I guess we'll find out. <clears throat> well, well, if this is my last chance to say anything to you, forgive you. It's just not in me. But I can't carry this hate for you anymore, man. So let's set things right. You and me. Fighting! Yeah. 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 
said. Better make it count, right? Maybe try things my way sometime. I'm not sure I make out. Convincing hero. Won't know until you try. had to drain his power into it to save him. It looks like it had an effect. Wait, you two work together? I wasn't about to let you die. Miles, that's... After so many times saying it, thank you seems soft. It's okay. I know. I don't deserve that kid. We lost you. Guess I should thank you. I spent years of my life consumed with vengeance. I lost everything for it. You two reminded me that that's not who I am. When you help someone, you help everyone. Where are you gonna go? To set things right. Your way. Wow. 
Reforming your greatest enemy. Can't say I've ever done that. Maybe MJ was right. Why would the city need me when it has you? <laughs> I don't know. This city still looks like a two Spider-Man job to me. of Harry? Not yet. Ran into a speed bump. I think Miles just saved my life. What? What happened? There was symbiote left inside of me. It started taking over, but Martin Lee gave me his power. It feels different. Like the voices are gone, but the power is still there. That's incredible. And Pete, just wanted to let you know, I got my byline pulled off that article. And... Gave my landlord notice. Does that mean? It means if the world is gonna get turned into an alien wasteland, there's no one I'd rather be booed up with than you. Aw, oh, the feeling's mutual. <laughs> Keep an eye out for Harry. I'll let you know if I hear anything. Okay. While I look for Harry, I should see what else needs some spidey help. But as always here, it is absolute truth. Gooey black monsters have begun popping up around the city. I repeat, monsters are in our city, propagating and disseminating to ends unknown. We've heard numerous accounts of missing persons, families torn apart, friends and loved ones mysteriously disappearing. But now believe we can shed some light on the culprits. These vile creatures appear to be abducting us. For what nefarious purpose, we don't know yet. Now, more than ever, we need to look out for each other. Don't go out alone, unless it's an emergency. You could be next. I fear the worst is yet to come. data on who Craven's hunting.
Craven was hunting an influencer? What, did he think this kid had powers? Not exactly big game. Why all the trouble for some civilians? Dr. Connors? Hello? He's here in my lab. Gotta call Miles and get over there quick. Miles, meet me at Connors' lab. I think Harry's there, and it doesn't sound good. On my way. Should be a shortcut to Connors' lab near Central Park. I've gotta find a way to get through to Harry. He's in there. I know I can reach him. Just hope he doesn't hurt Connors. What are you gonna do with that thing? I think we're about to find out. You need to know. Harry's gone. Host and symbiote are perfectly fused. I'll find a way to save him. You can't. But you can still stop the symbiote. How? By killing the host. Please, save my boy.
Spider-Man. I know you're seeing what I'm seeing right now. We've got a lot of New Yorkers being attacked by these... things. I'm on it. Stay safe out there. All he needed was that meteorite. Now he can heal the world. This isn't what we meant. Just to be safe, I recommend going home as soon as you can. Oh my god, thank you. I swear, I'm moving to Jersey. Those civilians are in trouble. I'm coming! Stop until they get inside. I'll take care of these things. Just stay inside the bus. There are nests popping up everywhere. Sending you coordinates now. Got it. Watch yourself out there, man. This is something else. Harry. I'll find you, buddy. I'll find you. Somewhere. That suit's not an alien, is it? <laughs> it's time for a Miles Morales original, you know? One of one. <laughs> it looks 
しく。What happened, man? Harry got the meteorite. I, uh, I couldn't stop him. Connor said we can't save him, so we have. I can't lose him, Miles. I can't do this again. I saw May when I was in your head. It's not your fault, Pete. She wanted to save you, to save all of us. She never thought about herself, even when she was struggling to breathe. If May, my dad, if they were here, they would want us to stop thinking about them. They'd want us to help people, to fight. Harry's still in there, and we're gonna fight like hell to get him back. Call the play, coach. <laughs> Let's split up. Cover more ground. You find the meteorite. I'll clear that nest out. You got it, Spider-Man. started. Stay focused, Pete. Oh, 
Lord. Miles, we need you. Still here. Please. No way that thing is talking to me. Come with us. What the hell? Where am I? Symbiotes. You are safe here. Everyone you love is safe here. My head. I have to find a way out. Why would you leave? We are here. You can be too. You, Peter. Us. This isn't where I belong, Harry. Neither do you. Come on, Miles. Come on! Let us heal you. Bring us, Peter. It's not the way, Harry. You know that. Haley? What are you showing me? in trouble. Pete, I saw the meteorite. It's under the Harlem subway station, next to the bridge. Heading there now! Wait for me, though, man. Harry, he's after you. I have to go help Haley, but just wait, all right? Whoa, whoa, back up! What happened? I got sucked into the high pine. I saw this vision of the meteorite underground, but I've got a bad feeling. You think Harry's there? I'm serious, Pete. Just give me 10 minutes. You cannot do this alone. Right. Call me when you're done. Sorry, Miles, but I can't waste any time. There's the subway entrance. Miles has to be right. That's where the meteorite is. Just have to clear out this bridge. Everyone stay in your cars. I won't let them hurt you. Harry! Get up! I know you're here! Yes! I'm here, buddy! I know! Just hang on! I'm coming! Subway tunnel. Hey, everything all good with Haley? Not yet, but you still owe me a few more minutes. Hang tight. 
I was, I was trying to save you. You're incredible. I, I like you so much, and I think you like me. Do you want to go out? Hey, on a date? Is that a yes? <laughs> well, it's a date then. After all this is over. Hey, buddy. I talked to Dr. Connors. He says you're too far gone, but I know that's not true. Harry, I messed up. I was terrible to you. Your dream, our dream, healing the world. I'm sorry. Seeing a rock. No? Hold on. I'm nearly to you. Thanks for coming, Pete. We want to show you something. Harry, what are you? We are healed. Finally free. We can give that gift. Everyone. But we 
We all need to meet it by May's house. What's going on out there, guys? It's the meteorite that the symbiote arrived in. He's using it to transform the city. I know where it is. And we're gonna steal it. Time to game plan. I'm in. See you guys at home. One's got a cute backpack. Central Park Reservoir. The water system. Pumping goo everywhere, adding more and more people to the hive mind. If all those symbiotes get out of Manhattan. Goodbye, Earth. Hello, planet goo. The meteorite is the source of all the power, right? Creating goo, creating symbiotes. But it was useless until Harry repaired it. Yeah. And that particle accelerator is what damaged it in the first place. Cut off a piece at low power. Right, so what if we crank the power up? Like way past 11. Might destroy it. And free everyone connected to the hive mind. Theoretically. But that reservoir's gotta be mobbed with symbiotes. And you know Harry's not gonna let that rock out of his sight. Unless he sees something he wants more. Me. Just, you know, for illustrative purposes. Harry's still Harry. He thinks he's healing the world. But the dream isn't complete without... His best friend beside him. I can lead Harry away from the meteorite. And I can handle all the symbiotes. While I grab the space rock. For illustrative purposes. All right. Fire up the accelerator. No more hive mind. World saved. We all get churros? <laughs> Theoretically. Pete, what Connor said about Harry being too far gone. If you can't save him, are you won't ready? come to that. You two will be able to destroy the rock in time. Let's heal the world. For real this time. Somewhere in that thing? So are Harry and his friends. Here. I figured you could use a sonic touch. <sighs> They're just standing there. What are they waiting for? Look, I can't thank you both enough. For everything. Oh, come on, bro. We're the Spire team. <sighs> Don't anyone forget it? Hey, 
buddy! You gonna sit in there and play with your pet rock all night? It's you and me, Harry. Like we always wanted. Almost out of this hello. 
Your plus one isn't invited to our high school reunion, Harry! Harry!
Why do you keep fighting us? You're not giving me a choice! Symbiote's dropping in. It's not working! Heal the world with you! Not like this! The meteorite. You took it from us! Aliens 
glad we took their stuff. Yeah, well, they started it. That's why. Yeah. 
us apart. Maybe I was, but Pete wasn't Pete. You think you're better than us, don't you? This ain't about who's better. I just prefer you without the psycho alien on.
Either way, Pete. No, no, no. We still have time? No, we don't. It'll kill them. And then it'll kill you. Let's heal the world, Pete. Together. some room. I don't know if it's gonna work, but I gotta try.
Harry. Pulse is weak. We gotta move. What have you done? What have you done to him? Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm coming with you. Wait. There are traces of brain activity, but his chances of coming back are very slim. Just keep him alive. Get the G serum ready. ASAP. For the last few years, tragedy has tried to tear the city apart. But we somehow kept going. We battled sickness, evil, Cataclysm. We are tired, anxious, stressed, numb. But we have never lost hope. The city needs to heal. We're all ready to return to normal, but what is normal? What if it no longer exists? Over the last half hour, I've talked about how these events have changed me. But what about you? In this ongoing series, I will be talking with people throughout the city, exploring our new behaviors, new routines, new thoughts and feelings. I hope you'll join me on this journey. This has been Mary Jane Watson, and you're listening to The New Normal. Episode one, done. Nice. <laughs> I don't know. Ooh, are these good to go? In a minute, I want to show you something first. Okay. It has molasses in it. Yum, I'll take those. <laughs> Thanks again for the donation, Peter. Have you talked to Miles about? Not yet. Uh... 
You ready? Uh, Miles. I've been meaning to talk to you uh, about some. Uh, I mean, I have been talking to you there all, all the time. It's, it's, it's great uh, to talk. So many good talks. Uh, I just haven't been talking to you about what I should have been talking to you about. Pete. Uh, wait, uh, let me start again. I got this. All of it. Go be Peter Parker for a while. Are you, are you sure it's, it's a big city? I can handle it. As long as I can still call you for advice. You don't need it. <sighs> Maybe not now, but there'll come a time. I'm here for you, always. Bro. See you. What do you want? The Spider-Men. You know who they are, don't you? Why? They ruined my son. loss. Even you, Norman. What are you writing? The final chapter. Hi. I hope you're hungry. Food's almost ready. Why don't you go show her your essay? He worked so hard on it. in Harlem, probably seen him volunteering in the city, helping out his city council mom, and trying to live up to his hero dad. Yeah.
Yeah. Haley, this is Albert. Uh, hi. Nice to meet you. Oh, and uh, <laughs> this is my daughter, Cindy. <laughs> <laughs> 